which is Josh Kozlowski is in with the forecast for the AMP concert. I know, I think it's the first one of the season. It is. Uh, I know some folks are actually going tonight and they kept texting me today saying, is it gonna rain, is it gonna rain? And you yeah. said, you, yesterday you said maybe in the evening and I said, I think we're gonna hold out. I think we're gonna be okay, okay good. for tonight. Just some clouds and temperatures, you know, get pretty comfortable. Temperature when you're walking up there in the parking lot, doing some tailgating, whatever's happening there, 78 degrees looks good. Concert start time is seven o'clock, 76 degrees, clouds, some sun. Should be a nice sunset, I think, this evening, pretty sky. And maybe very late tonight, I'm talking like way before, you know, end of the nighttime hours, before midnight probably, 10, 11 o'clock, temperatures near 70, some clouds, maybe some sprinkles in the area, small chance of a shower. But again, that's way later on in the night. Okay, let's get you caught up on the Memorial Day weekend forecast here. Looks like for right now, Saturday, we're going to find some rain in the morning, then decreasing clouds midday and afternoon, high temperature 70. Saturday night, pretty comfortable and cool, 52, looks good. Sunday, nicer, sunnier, high temperatures, upper 70s to near 80. And Sunday night looks pretty comfortable as well, temperatures down near 60. And for the holiday itself, hazy and hot. I'm going a high of 87 degrees that day, a few degrees shy of potentially maybe tying a record. We'll see. Temperatures this evening right now, it's 79 here in Syracuse, Utica Roma 80, Fulton 81. A little bit cooler for Cortland and Ithaca, a pair of 73s there and 80 right now up in Watertown. A very comfortable evening, you're doing some grilling, going for a walk, whatever it may be. Live Triple Doppler brought to you by Falso Service Experts. Again, on our neck of the woods, pretty quiet right here, but you can see some sprinkles out over Lake Ontario, and some of those could kind of meander over our way very late tonight. And probably overnight, there could be a few showers passing through, probably after midnight. Big picture from space with the satellite combined with the local radars. Uh, large area of low pressure spinning away over St. Louis, Missouri. A couple of severe thunderstorm and tornado warnings in the state of Kentucky at this hour. For some convection there that's getting a little bit more, you know, amplified by some dynamics in the atmosphere. And our neck of the woods tomorrow, we could be seeing maybe the small, small chance of a couple of gustier storms. There could be some potential flash flooding. They had a couple warnings, I believe, out in Illinois earlier today for that with some you know, downpours kind of training over the same areas again and again. Small chance for some damaging wind gusts, very small chance for some small hail. We'll keep an eye on things for you all day long tomorrow. Futurecast this evening, we're good to go. Temperature is kind of settling down to the 70s, the 60s, very late tonight. Again, a couple flashes of green there could represent some sprinkles and showers in the area. And then tomorrow morning, waking up, maybe partially wet grass and roads, off and on rain and thunder. Maybe it could downpour for a bit, the sun could come back out. And then you kind of repeat that kind of pattern. High temperatures will be in the 70s to maybe up near 80. And for later tomorrow night, maybe some more rain. Tough call on Saturday if we can get the sun out beyond midday. I don't know. We'll see how it goes at the end of the day. That looks way too cool. I think temperatures on Saturday will be closer to 70. Overnight, we're in the 60s. Tomorrow, 78. Not raining every hour of tomorrow. Saturday near 70 once we can get the rain out of the way. Sunday and Memorial Day look good in the 80s. Staying hot Tuesday and Wednesday and small chance of rain later in the week. Michael. Thank you, Josh. Coming up.